So this is a brand new 3040T CNC engraving machine. So here's the controller. The device I probably think it's defective. All the uh, connectors are properly installed. Peri port connector, the device connector, the stepper motors move smoothly and probably all seems correctly installed. So the quality of the machine is, is rather fine and robust. And you can see here the hardware parallel port connector of the TKRS1 Toshiba notebook 1.6 GHz 512 MB RAM. And here you can see the device manager with the parallel port EPP. Configured, configured so there's no interrupt in between or no DMA configuration but bi directional parallel port, which is the uh, default for CNC machines. Okay, so the, the Mach drivers are also properly installed, there's no, no failure in the configuration, you can see no problems here. So this is a device, I guess, which has a problem. I will show this now by loading the Mach, Mach 3 mil software. Just some seconds. Okay, I can show you in between. The controller works properly with the spindle. With the spindle. Now, if you turn on the spindle. moves properly, the controller is, is on, the software is now loaded and uh, I just take a few uh, sneak view at the config. So we have, uh, we have again the, the parallel port configuration and here we have the proper configuration shown as in the manual. No input signals, no output signals. All other uh, configurations are default except the, the motor control which is now also according to the manual. But it's it's not necessary uh, the spindle set up for for the movement of the axis. Okay. I will reset the machine and enter the manual mode of Mach Mach 3. And now I move the X axis. And you can see it moves. Other direction moves. Okay. Now I take the other axis. Epsilon. Again. I press nothing happens. Other direction nothing happens. Only the numbers. But not the machine moves. 
the same or that axis. The numbers change, the position changes, but nothing happens on the axis. So I checked all the cables, I checked the controller cables, here I checked the parallel port cables and I came to the conclusion that only the controller can be defective. So it's brand new and I want a replacement. Thank you for watching.